This is Lagun Slinga, dime drop of the sixth. The guy that got traded for the Statue of Liberty. The Jets needed a savior because their old brittle QB got hurt in the first four plays. Rodgers actually did the Jets a favor because Lagun has destroyed every NFL record and have the Jets the one seed in the playoffs. This should be all the talk in the NFL, but let's throw it to Scott to explain what the hot topic is. Good evening, Sports Nation. Gather round because we've got some seriously mind-blowing stuff happening in the world of LSHD. The NFL playoffs are upon us. And naturally, we should be raving about the one and only Lagun Slinga Dime Drop of the Six. I mean, the guy practically throws touchdowns in his sleep. But wait, hold the phone. The LSHD bigwigs have decided that we should redirect our attention to none other than Travis Kelts and Taylor Swift. Yeah, you heard that right. The dude who catches footballs and the pop sensation. Because, you know, nothing screams football more than a love story for the ages. I mean, come on, folks. Lagun Slinga is out there racking up stats like it's nobody's business. He's got more passing yards than most of us have in Instagram followers, but no, forget all that because Taylor Swift's got albums to sell and what better way to boost those ticket sales than with a good old sports romance? Seriously, do you really believe T-Swizzle is genuinely interested in this guy when she could have her pick of any man on this planet? I mean, come on. She's the queen of breakup songs and she's supposed to be head over heels for a football player? Classic diversion tactic, my friends. So there you have it. Sports Nation, the wild and wacky world of LSHD where touchdowns take a back seat to Taylor Swift's dating life. Stay tuned for more eyebrow-raising headlines, because you never know what's coming next. Oh, folks, brace yourselves, because the unthinkable has occurred. The Chiefs have been prematurely booted from the playoffs, and that can only mean one thing. No more Swifties in the stands. Yep, the Chiefs got the boot, and Taylor Swift's gonna need to find a new tailgate crew. So, what happened? Well, the Chiefs lost to the Bills, and Travis Kelsey managed a whopping three catches for 50 yards. Ouch, Travis, not exactly a stat line that's gonna impress T-Swift, is it? Poor Travis. It looks like you're destined for eternal fame in the world of heartbreak anthems. I can already hear the lyrics. Caught three passes, couldn't make it last. Now you're just a chapter in my past. Seriously, Taylor, save some material for the rest of us. So, farewell to the Chiefs. Ladies and gentlemen, hold on to your nachos because we've got a Jets versus Bills playoff showdown on our hands. This should be the talk of the town, but hold up a second. Taylor Swift is once again spotted in the stands. Rumors are swirling around the stadium like confetti at a T-Swizzle concert. Is she now a die-hard football fan? Or is there another player on the field who's managed to catch her eye? The mystery deepens, but here's the kicker, folks. The only player on that field who's consistently been a winner is none other than Lagoon Sling a Dime, Droppa, the sixth. Here's where it gets interesting. Interesting. Insiders close to Dime Droppa are starting to wonder if he's too invested in football. I mean, he's just 14 years old, and he's dating a 33-year-old diva? Talk about a generation gap. Taylor Swift, football, and a teenage sensation's love life. Who would have thought these would all collide in one hilarious playoff spectacle? The Jets have crushed the Bills, and that should be all the talk with Lagun Slinga leading them to a win in the playoffs. But no, the Swifties want to know more about Lagun Slinga. Will Taylor be at the next game? It's the AFC Championship game, and the road to a Super Bowl goes through New York. It's the Chargers and the Jets. This is the AFC Championship with the NFL's GOAT playing La Gunslinger Dime Droppa, the sixth. Unfortunately, all the talk is still about Taylor Swift. Yes, folks, she is in the building yet again. There are rumors flying around that there is tension between Miss Swift and the 14-year-old. We have someone on it, and as soon as we hear any information, we will let you all know. Now an option play on second down. shot in the big game, their big playability. They can strike from anywhere. Head on to their lead. Boy, 
still in the first quarter, and look out. I mean, they are on pace for over 80 points. Back down memory lane a little bit because we have had a few guys come close. Think about Patrick Mahomes in 2018. Second year in the league, but his first as a full-time starter. I go back to 2000 with the Vikings and Dante Culpepper. Touchdown run, Charles. Remember, he also had a catch on this drive as well. And that's what running backs want to be in today's NFL. And that one got knocked away. He'll try again with the arm here on second down. Being chased out left. Shedding the tackle that gives him some room. Breaking news. We have learned that Taylor Swift has left the game at halftime and she didn't look too happy. Rumor is the relationship between Taylor and Dime Droppa is already over and looks like Lagun Slinga is the one that broke it off. Maybe this time, Lagun will write a song about the breakup. Well, the Jets are moving to the Super Bowl, and that should be all the talk. But no Taylor Swift is in all the headlines because rumor has it that her fling with the 14-year-old Lagun Slinga dime drop of the sixth is already over. Taylor left the game at halftime, not very happy at all. And when Lagun was asked about it at the press conference, he said no comment. Ladies and gentlemen, we have breaking news. There was a Swifty rally, and you see Taylor speaking to all the Swy fights. This sounds very tense and angry. Then we have this footage of a van pulling up and taking Lagun Slinga. We are being told that the Swifties have kidnapped Lagun Slinga before the Super Bowl. What will the Jets do? When we get more information, we will pass it along. Meanwhile, back in the New York Jets office, they are calling the police but are not getting any help. Head coach Robert Sala knows exactly who to call. None other than La Steroid Daddy Hack the Fourth. For those of you that do not know who La Steroid is, he is the greatest baseball player of all time and is the 12-year-old cousin to Lagun Slinga. La Steroid got a hot tip that Lagun was in an abandoned house on the west side of town. He made his way into the home and went up the stairs. He finally found Lagun tied up on a pole and with a mask over his head. Problem with all of this, it is already Super Bowl Sunday. They made a run to the airport and had to get to Las Vegas. They landed on the strip, but La Steroid got Lagun Slinga to the game on time. It took Lagun Slinga some time to get adjusted to the game. I mean, he was jet-lagged, hadn't had anything to eat for seven days, and now playing in the biggest game of his career. The team finally got him some hydration and food, and then that was all he needed. After that, he punished the Falcons. People in the stands watched the GOAT treat the Falcons' defense like they were in peewee football. up this secondary all game long and this time I don't think he's going to be shy about continuing to run for first down instead of airing it out and they run the option here on first and ten runs over the big man get the oxygen tank ready and he's going to take it in for a Jets touchdown their mobile quarterback play. those broken tackles those weren't easy to get by no they really weren't and they've had trouble tackling throughout this ball game but it's combined on those last two plays. And the New York Jets have won the Super Bowl. And the Lombardi Trophy will be in the Big Apple. The city of New York thought they were giving up too much for Lagun Slinga Dime Drop of the Sixth when they gave up the Statue of Liberty. In reality, though, Las Vegas Raiders got ripped off. New York City has their Super Bowl trophy plus the best player to ever play the game of football. All thanks to Lesteroid Daddy Hack the Fourth. If you want to see the matchup of the century between Laboomstick Body Bag the Third and Lagun Slinga Dime Drop of the Sixth, we need 5,000 likes and we will make it happen.